Ukrainian army ready to break flank. Prigozhin said that counter-offensive would begin on May the 2nd. Wagner leader Yevgeny Prigozhin threw a real tantrum over the fact that the Ukrainian soldiers are about to go on a counter-offensive and there is no one to cover his mercenaries. According to Prigozhin's press service, he believes that the armed forces of Ukraine will go on a counter-offensive after May the 2nd when the rainy season ends and the wind dries up the soil. Today is raining. The last rain is due on May the 2nd. It takes another week for the wind to dry the soil. After that, the Ukrainian army will be ready to move. Will they do it on May the 9th to ruin the holiday? Maybe yes, maybe not, maybe not so. It's only here in Russia that everything is done on holidays on March the 8th and May the 9th. The armed forces of Ukraine are ready to completely go and cut the flanks. No one covered our flanks, Prigozhin said. He stated that all these talks of the RF Ministry of Defense about supposedly covering Wagner's flanks are completely nonsense. Moreover, neither the Wagner nor the regular troops of the Russian Federation are given ammunition. Prigozhin considers this a decision of the criminal command. In addition, Prigozhin complained that Wagner's human resources were allegedly drying up due to losses and the release of mercenaries. The information space was filled with news about the expected counter-offenses of the armed forces of Ukraine. However, a limited circle of people knows about the true plans of the army. Recently, President Volodymyr Zelensky announced events that will give the Ukrainian armed forces more weapons. Zelensky said that Ukraine is actively preparing new military brigades and units. Ukrainian intelligence said that Ukraine would never agree to give someone part of its land and the war would end with a return to the 1991 borders. According to the forecast of intelligence chief Kirill Budanov, the armed forces of Ukraine will enter the Crimea in the spring.